What if I told you that you build a fully functional AI-powered app in less than five minutes without writing a single line of code? Yeah, I know that sounds crazy, but stick with me. I'm about to show you exactly how to do it using UWare AI. And trust me, by the end of this video, you're gonna wanna try this yourself. Let's dive in. So what exactly is UWare? Think of it as your AI coding buddy that lives in your browser. It's basically a vibe coding platform where you just chat with AI, tell it what you wanna build, and boom, bam, it creates a full stack application for you. We're talking about going from idea to design to code to deployment, all with simple prompts and one-click actions. Now here's what makes UWare absolutely insane. First, it has built-in integrations with powerful AI tools like VO3 for video generation, Nano Banana for image creation, and even Midjourney. Second, you can turn your Figma designs into live websites just by dropping a link. Third, it handles backend code, so you can build actual interactive features like comment sections and live polls. And fourth, this is my favorite part, um, they have a creator incentive program where you can actually earn real money from the projects you create and share. They're literally paying you to be creative. Before we dive into building something, let me quickly show you what people are already creating with this platform, because honestly, it's mind-blowing. Check this out. Someone built an AI Polaroid maker that turns your photos into vintage Polaroid-style images. Another creator made an AI action figure generator powered by Nano Banana that transforms your selfies into custom action figures. There's even a cat interview video generator using VO3 that creates hilarious interview videos with cats. I'm not making this up. And these aren't just static demos. These are fully deployed shareable apps that anyone can use. You can find all of these on UWare's trending projects page. And honestly, scrolling through them is like falling down a rabbit hole of creativity. The best part? Each of these was built by regular people just chatting with AI. No computer science degree required. All right, enough talking about what other people made. Let's actually build something together. Okay, let's start our journey with UWare. So first things first, head over to uware.com. I'll drop the link in the description below. You'll land on this clean interface that says, tell it, build it. And that's literally the whole philosophy here. You tell it what you want and it builds it. First, we have to create an account. So click on the sign in button and then create your account. Once you are logged in, you are ready to create your app. Now for this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to build an AI powered yearbook photo generator. You know those retro 80s and 90s yearbook photos that went viral? Yeah, we're building that. And we're going to do it in under 10 minutes. All right, so you see this input field at the bottom? This is where the magic happens. But before we start prompting, I wanna show you something really cool, the MCP box. Click on that little icon next to the input field. This opens up what UWare calls their MCP tools. Basically, these are all the integrations and APIs you can use in your project. You've got Nano Banana for image generation, VO3, Sora 2 for video, backend tools for databases, Figma integration, YouTube, Google Maps, Supabase. It's like a buffet of powerful tools. For our yearbook generator, we're going to use the AIA MCP. So just tick that box. This tells you where that we want to build an app with AI features. Simple as that. Now comes the fun part. In the input field, I'm going to type, build an AI yearbook photo generator app that transforms uploaded photos into retro 80s and 90s yearbook style portraits with customizable backgrounds and effects. See how I'm being specific? I'm telling it exactly what I want, the style, the functionality, the era. The more specific you are, the better results you'll get. After entering the prompt, you can attach any document or file if you want. Now, set the LLM model. You will find GPT, Claude, Kimi, GLM, and more options. I will select the GPT-5 codex model. Once everything is set, hit the send button. UWare's AI is now processing our request. You can see it's thinking through the project structure, setting up the interface, and generating the code. Behind the scenes, a sophisticated orchestration is at work. The platform seamlessly manages API calls, handles various response types, and coordinates the results efficiently. This will take some time. So, I am fast forwarding the video. Okay, look at this. It's already created a full interface for us. On the left side, we've got an upload section where users can drop their photos. In the middle, there's a preview area. On the bottom left, 
you will find options for different yearbook styles. It even added options I didn't explicitly ask for. Let's try our first creation. I am uploading a random image. Once the image is uploaded, you can see a preview of the selected template. You can change the template from here. Here, at the bottom of the preview panel, you can change the aspect ratio. Another important feature is that you can upload multiple images and turn them into a yearbook image. Once everything is set, hit the Generate All button. Now after waiting for some time, I got these images. And look at the image quality. Our newly built AI did a great job. So, our AI is working perfectly. Now this is where UWare really shines. If you're a developer, you can click on the code view and see all the actual code it generated. It's real functional code, HTML, CSS, everything. But if you're not a coder, you don't even need to look at it. You can just work with the visual interface. Now, let's say I want to tweak something. Maybe I want to add a feature where users can add custom text to their yearbook photos, like a quote or their name. I can just type in the chat. Add a text input field where users can add custom quotes to their yearbook photos and display it below the portrait. Hit enter and watch UWare update the app in real time. And done. Now if you upload any image, you will find the quote box under the preview image. This is what I mean by vibe coding. You're literally just having a conversation with AI and it's building your app as you talk. I will try it later. Before that, let me make one more adjustment. I'll type, make the background color more vibrant and add a gradient effect to match the retro aesthetic. And boom, look at that. The whole color scheme just updated. The interface now has this cool gradient that really captures that nostalgic yearbook vibe. All right, let's actually test this thing. I'm going to upload a photo. I'll use this random photo here. Upload the image and then click on Generate Processing and check that out. It transformed the photo into a perfect 80s yearbook portrait with that soft focus effect, the classic blue background, everything. Now let me add a quote. Most likely to build apps with AI. Hit Generate and there it is. The quote appears below the portrait in that classic yearbook font. This is actually working. Let me try a different style. I'll click on Denim Dreams. And wow, look at that transformation. Now it's got that edgy 90s look with the darker tones and grunge aesthetic. This is so cool. Now here's where it gets even better. You know how usually deploying a website is this whole complicated process with hosting, domains, servers, all that stuff. Uware makes it ridiculously simple. See this publish button at the top right? That's it. That's all you need to click. One button. I'm clicking it now. And just like that, Uware is deploying our app. This takes about 10 to 15 seconds. And done. Look at this. We now have a live shareable URL. This app is now live on the internet. Anyone can access it. I can share this link on social media, send it to friends, put it in my portfolio, whatever I want. And you can try it completely free. Now, what if you don't have a computer? Still, you can create an AI app using your mobile phone because Uware has a mobile app version. Just scan the QR code or search for Uware on the Play Store. Once the app is installed, log in to your account. Once you are logged in, your interface will be like this. Now, you have to enter the prompt here in this box. So, type what you want in your app. After entering the prompt, hit the Send button. And here it is. Like the web version, the app has started its work and is building the app. It will take some time to generate the app. So, I am fast forwarding the video. And here it is. The app is ready. You can preview or download the app. This looks really amazing, like a professional AI video generator mobile app. You can see all the options and features. Let's try the text to video generation feature. Select the model, generation type, video size, duration, and then enter the text prompt. Once done, hit the generate button. You can see that the video is being generated. And here it is, the video is ready. You can preview it here or download the video. So now you can create your own AI-powered mobile app using Uware AI. So you can now create anything using the power of Uware AI. Now remember when I mentioned you can earn money from your projects? Here's how that works. When you share your project and people use it, you earn credits. You can see this by clicking on the share button. It shows you how many people have viewed and used your project. Uware has this whole Creator Studio dashboard where you can track your earnings. The more people engage with your projects, the more you earn. 
and they also have an affiliate program where you can earn 25% commission by referring people to the platform. I'll drop that link in the description too. So not only are you building cool stuff and learning, but you're potentially making money while doing it. That's pretty wild. The platform is completely free to start, and honestly, it's one of those things where you just need to experience it to understand how powerful it is. Plus, with that creator incentive program, you might even make some money from your projects. If you build something cool, drop the link in the comments below. I'd love to see what you create. And if you found this tutorial helpful, smash that like button and subscribe because I'll be making more UWare tutorials showing you how to build specific types of apps. The link is in the description, it's also pinned in the comments. Go check it out, and I'll see you in the next video. Now go build something awesome.